I am the WL, here are some of the best Minecraft command, command block and redstone creations. That will just blow your mind. Let's start off strong with one of the best people in the redstone community, you probably heard of him already, he goes by the name of Matt Bat Wings. I'll have him and everyone else in this video linked in the description, but for his first project he has made Flappy Bird using only redstone. Player momentaneously using command blocks has made an iris. That looks kind of satisfying. Player Civic Kitty, using a total of 654 commands, has made a realistic keyboard and has actually turned this into a data pack. Player Maria Rov, using command blocks, has created the snake game but in Minecraft. That actually works pretty well. Player Oli Edge might win the record for most command blocks in a single build. This took over 1,200 command blocks just to create this really smooth opening door effect. And it's pretty smooth. If you're enjoying the video and want to see more, make sure to subscribe to my channel with notifications on. I don't get that many subs these days, so it's appreciated. Player Goggled Gecko has made a data pack in Bedrock that has allowed him to make his very own 3D engine. He has made Minecraft in Minecraft. And of course, the number one question he got was, can it play Doom? Matt Bat Wings back again, make sure to go check him out. He makes some incredible things. And this time he's made the unbeatable redstone tic-tac-toe, where you can actually play against AI. The cool thing about this one is you can actually download the map, which I'll have linked in the description as well. And it's actually kind of hard to believe that this is fully redstone. Using command blocks, player Ziggy Kak has made a working shower. Is he implying something? Using command blocks, Mr. Cookie Princess has made a working TV. And I love this show. Can it play the daily dose of Minecraft? I wonder. Jigabob is showing how cool the camera command is. It wouldn't be a Derpy Well video without showing something satisfying. Okay, okay, let's go back to some of the crazy stuff. Player by the name of I'm Square So I'm Not There, which is pretty fun to say, has made an 8x8 tunnel generator. And he goes into details about how he did it, and he kind of explains how he could actually be double the size, which is actually crazy. Speaking of crazy, Player Rebane 2001 has made a QR generator in Minecraft using only redstone. You give it a phrase or a couple of characters, and it will convert that into a QR code using only redstone. If you want to try it out for yourself, there's a map download link in the description. Yep, he's back. Matt Batwings back again. When you're the king of redstone, you're going to get featured quite a lot in a compilation video like this. And this time he's made a graphing calculator with once again only redstone. The build took him over a month to create and the machine can graph pretty much anything up to 38 characters long. Once again, download link in the description. Go send him some love. This is actually a really cool idea. Mr. Insane is miles ahead of the game. And if you're interested in how he did it, I've linked his YouTube channel where he actually does a lot of redstone tutorials. Player Lord John 25 with the use of redstone has made the largest piston in Minecraft that I've found to date. He's also a YouTuber that makes really good videos. I'll have him linked in the description. Definitely go check him out. Here's something you don't see every day, an observer only 5x5 piston door. That works surprisingly well. I think I might say this player's name wrong, but not intentionally. A player by the name of Arpheus, Artifius, hopefully I said that right, has made Space Invaders using only redstone, and the redstone on this one is intense. And I feel like he would upload it with, it's really quite simple really. Or simple redstone build. Once again, if you want to play it, I'll have his YouTube link down below. Mm -hmm. 
So this one isn't like a crazy command creation. It's just showing off one of the commands you can do in Minecraft. And recently, although not that recently, they added in a size attribute that you can apply to mobs. And this player's done that in the most terrifying way. Teddy Computer was bored, so he programmed an infinite parkour that will just keep going and going as long as he doesn't fall. And we already know this is going to be background footage for TikTok AMAs or TikTok Reddit stories. Once again, link in the description. This next one is a classic and you might have seen it, it's kind of infamous and it's one of the first command block creations I think I ever saw that kind of blew my mind. Player Shrimpery Seagull with the use of 1000 command blocks has made this animation and this is quite old but despite it being so old it still compares itself well to other things being made today. Going from old to new, Firebolt 360 has made Angry Birds in Minecraft using the new minecart mechanics that have came out in the latest snapshot. I featured this in my Daily Dose episode and I called it Flappy Birds because I was looking, I, was, I don't know why. I had it on my script to say Angry Birds and I just said Flappy. I got a lot of comments for that. Once again, people playing around with the new size attribute, again, not that new. And in this case, going from creepy spiders, why are creepers kind of cute when they're small? This one probably has to be the funniest one I think I'm featuring in this episode. This player has made it so fish could walk, and I clicked on it and I was like, how can fish walk? And, and this was his solution, and I guess it makes sense. That is one walking fish. Be free. Kian Jevengai, another person in the community who is really good at what they do, and he specifically focuses on command block creations. If ever you want to see anything cool and interesting with command blocks, definitely go check out his channel. He makes some really cool things. Sha Fang has made an automatic, intricate bridge builder. And I see intricate because it actually has a pretty cool design to it. It's not just a flat bridge, it's something that you would think a player would have made. Whoever said circles couldn't be in Minecraft, well, they were wrong. Kevin Jan guy back again, this time he's showing off a data pack that brings the nether into the overworld. And if left unchecked, will consume your whole world. Well, I bet you didn't know that real life redstone exists because Heckback is an absolute legend and has a load of projects and videos on his channel where he's brought redstone into real life. And this time he's made a modular system, but he's also made piston doors and all the things you would expect from Minecraft put in real life. Kevin J and Guy showing us 3D holograms using commands and colored particles. And he's even added in movement, which is kind of mad. If you want to learn how he does it, he goes into details in his posts, and I think he actually explains a lot of his videos on his channel.
Duran231 with the use of 750 command blocks has made a computer that has a lot of functionality. He has added paint for one which actually allows you to draw and then save that image to that hard drive and then if you want to bring it back you can. The same thing with notes and he's also added in a calculator which is mind blowing. And in case if that wasn't enough he's also added in tic-tac-toe. Download link in the description. People really like bringing other games into Minecraft, and I really like Stairs. That wasn't a statement, that's actually this player's name, I really like Stairs, and he has made Geometry Dash using only redstone. No command blocks in this one. If you want to learn more about his project, or actually just play the map itself, I've linked his YouTube channel down below, he seems very underrated, so go check him out. Not everyone out here is building these entire games, some people are just making automation to make their life easier. And that's the case with Gemstone Gauntlet, who has made these redstone machines to drain the ocean for him saving him probably hours if not days of time and effort. Lane HD was making a world that was all around redstone and command blocks, and this is his first video to come out of that, just showing off the door, which is pretty impressive. And what better way to end the video, showing off my personal favourite creation from Map Bat Wings, playable chess in Minecraft. And once again, this is all redstone, not a single command block in this build, which is just mind blowing. How does he even do it? Make sure to go check him out and everyone else in this video. If you like their project, go send them some love and tell them the Derpy World sent you. If you enjoyed the video, subscribe. Thanks for watching.